Hello there and welcome back to another video and today I'm going to be sharing uh, a theory that I saw um, somewhere, I can't remember where, about uh, the Watcher. So, let's get into it. So, for those of you who don't know or need a bit of a refresher, the Doctor is a sort of being that came to the fourth Doctor at in his regeneration story, Logopolis. And um, I found this really interesting theory. First of all, the Watcher is this really sort of mist, misty, whitey sort of figure. And I've just always been fascinated by it from the very first scene when you see him in that field across from the motorway. I just find that scene so striking and a bit eerie and spooky. So... Um, let me show you the theory I saw. So there was this um, book published in the 90s, um, which had the Celestial Toy Maker as the villain. And there was a passage about uh, the Watcher saying um, that uh, they they come to all Time Lords at some point in their regeneration cycle. But it's a mystery to know when. So that... Uh, confirms uh, basically that this not just happens to the Doctor, this happens to every Time Lord. And also, uh, I saw this theory that uh, in part two of Legopolis, I think, um, that uh, when uh, the Watch is on the bridge uh, beckoning to Adric and the Doctor, um, he uh, goes up, goes up the gangplank to the bridge and um, and sort of speaks to the Watcher. Um, first of all, I don't believe he actually spoke to him um, because um, I think, because um, like, you didn't see any mouth movement or anything, so I think, like other creatures such as the face of Bo, I believe that he... Um, uh, sort of communicated sort of telepathically like saying things in his head um which i think is a really good idea and i definitely think the show should explore it more um and but i think that um as it says right in the fourth doctor's regeneration scene it says that well nissa says that um the watcher is the doctor so what um my theory is that, well, it was kind of mixed with someone else's online. I would give credit to them, but I can't remember who said it. Um, is that um, the Watcher is obviously the Doctor, but that is a version of the Fifth Doctor. So um, if the Doctor did nothing at Legopolis um, and stop the Master and the universe would just completely go kaput, um, I think then he'd regenerate into sort of that wispy form. And then um, the Time Lords, um, the Time Lords realise, sent the Watcher back to the end of the fourth Doctor's life before the events of Logopolis happened. Um and then sort of watch the Doctor, hence the name The Watcher, happened and sort of like uh, warned him about what could happen, what might happen if he didn't do anything. So um, that and then at the end, when they sort of like merge together and then Peter Davidson appears, I think uh, that happens because so they don't create a paradox that the Watcher doesn't exist anymore. So they merge together to create the Fifth Doctor's. Um, the Fifth Doctor's life form, if you get what I mean. So, um, uh, the Fifth Doctor isn't really the Fifth Doctor. He's more a sort of amalgamation of the Fourth Doctor and the Watcher, if you get what I mean. And I stumbled across that theory, and I found it really, compel really compelling and really interesting. So I'd like to know what your thoughts are um, on what The Watcher is. Do you like the concept or do you not? Do you wish it was a sort of thing left in the past? Personally, I'd love to see The Watcher again. He's always fascinated me. I just think it would be great. So let me know what you think of The Watcher and what your theories are for him. And do you like this sort of type of discussion video? I'd really like to hear what you think. Let me know in the comment section down below and hit the like button and subscribe and I will see you
in the next video. Bye!